to work tonight. And the punch right at the end. Both punches. Look at the look on the face of Manny Merciless Pacquiao. Look at the shot by Pacquiao. Nice body work right there. Coming straight in, which is and we're going to round two. And he's running across the ring. He can't wait. <laughs> Merciless Manny in Las Vegas. Beat Honolo Loaba. Cows in the red and blue trunks. Purple and gold Sanchez. Stop! Stop! As they clutch. Stop, stop. Looks like the heads just what? came together. We've got a headbutt. Marty Dinkins going to look at it. What are you calling? You know, they go to the scorecards what? after the fourth round. They're going to have to take a look at this. What an unfortunate occurrence. You see the blood spewing out because we were looking forward to a lot of action in this fight. And he has got an open cut. How unfortunate. Well, he's looking at it. Looks like they're going to continue, but there's going to be a lot of work in that corner. Strategy quite a bit for Pacquiao now because this is... Hard left hand backs Pacquiao into the ropes from Sanchez. Now Pacquiao's covering up a bit and countering. Now he backs Sanchez up. It's going to be difficult to see, so he can be vulnerable to the left hand from Sanchez. Sanchez trying to finish the champion of the IBF is bleeding quite a bit from that headbutt he suffered in the second round. Sanchez goes downstairs to the body, trying to work combinations. Sanchez wants to finish off what the headbutt started in this round. Under 40 seconds coming up. Round two, crowd acknowledging a great fight between two brave fighters out there. Very active. Sanchez continues to throw. Tries an uppercut. Crowd reacting to the uppercut. He came from a different angle that time. His corner wanted him to go more to the jab, up like that in the head, but Pacquiao's probably thinking, I may not, this thing may not go the distance in this situation. Let's, let's take a look at what happened. That is a nasty look. It's Pacquiao's fault, more or less, coming in and missing, and his momentum carried him right into Sanchez's head. So... It was more or less his lunge that caused this. He's that type of fighter. He's going to be aggressive and come straight in like that. I bleed on it. There's some Sanchez going to work here. Sanchez picked up the pace after the headbutt, seeing that Pacquiao was having trouble seeing out of that right eye. Sanchez working behind the jab. It's hard to tell who has the bout of the WBO and IBF junior featherweight title. Low blow. Down goes Pacquiao. Marty Dinkins going to talk to him. There's a warning being given to Sanchez. Probably the next time. Manny comes over the top with a nice left hand. That soft tissue area over the eye. They'll be Some good punching inside, but missing the mark. Sanchez lunging in. Almost another clash of heads. Pacquiao comes in to throw punches. You can see him squinting with his right eye a little bit. Fence, but he's won his last seven by stoppage. There's some good, good straight right followed by a left. Sanchez has to clutch and grab. Pacquiao more aggressive, determined. You can see him grimacing as he's trying to... Land some effective punches. Sanchez was standing there for a set there, but Pacquiao was unable, unable to see it or take advantage of it. Sanchez continues to throw hard punches Frank, inside. Stop! Stop! Marty Deacon sending Pacquiao to the corner. One point taken away from Sanchez now for another low blow. So that could be a very telling point in this fight, even though the bleeding is coming from Pacquiao. Sanchez has just gotten a point taken away for his second low pull down. There's another one that was right on the line, so Marty might have a little talk with Sanchez. Pacquiao will go to that corner and see how, with a point taken away toward the end of round three. One point. 
Let's take a look down to one knee in the corner. He didn't take long to recover. That kind of lifted everything up, but you can see immediately it affected him in here. He said, oh boy. Definitely low blow, below the belt line. And Pacquiao goes back to work later because he's a very aggressive fighter. Those of you who have not seen him before, this is only his second fight in the United from Sanchez. Sanchez is nine years older. This is his 42nd professional fight, 20 knockouts, station fight. WBO and IBF Junior Featherweight Championship. There's Pacquiao back to Sanchez in the corner. Classes though, they're always in pretty good shape. Back out, trying to unload now. Stop! The Sanchez pulling a little, deploying a little wrestling move there. Marty doesn't like it too much. But he did work his bat, double up his jab, but he, he's always looking for the big shot. Sanchez is not going to stand and have another low blow. Break! that Pacquiao was complaining about. But it wasn't a very hard shot. Pacquiao stepping in, throwing combinations. He's a warrior. Pacquiao's gonna continue, that's his style. Here comes Pacquiao stalking across the ring, trying a little uppercut inside, but basically trying holding up really well for considering how bad it's cut. Pacquiao, not a fan. There's another takedown. Sanchez, that could injure a fighter. Uh-oh, injury. Pacquiao is injured. Looks like his leg. Five minutes. Marty Dickens is going to give him five minutes. Pacquiao could be seriously... He's not happy with himself. He's got a hurt leg. I don't know exactly what it is. Knee? Could be his knee. Things were getting a little ugly from Sanchez. He had low blows in the last round, and then in this round, he did a basic takedown, and now you can see Merciless Manny is mad, as well he should be. He came here to fight. He came a long way to fight. There's a low blow right there. Once again, Sanchez has just turned this into a, 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 he slipped right there. Sanchez leaning on him. And I believe he stretched his knee. There's a low blow. And then Sanchez puts a wrestling takedown move as Manny was reacting to the low blow and also the slippage. Immediately starts holding his leg and it looks like a, a problem with the knee. We don't know quite. Now he has coming up on here. Manny Pacquiao is bleeding and he's got a hurt leg and he's out throwing shots. And Sanchez is not going to let him do it. He's going to tie him up. The bloody, but he's definitely got enough punch. Sanchez flicking the jab, throwing a wild left. Pacquiao now it's getting busy inside. Pacquiao wants to go. He wants it to go. Let's go. Punches on the rope for Manny Pacquiao. Sanchez fighting his way out of there. Sanchez coming back into the round. Crowd injured leg. Here's the last 20 seconds. That was kind of a shove there when Pacquiao went down a little bit. It was not a punch. He was not affected, but he got him riled up. He's riled up anyway, and here we go. Pacquiao stepping inside, trying to work on the inside. Sanchez. Taking some punches there, and at the end of this, watch Sanchez come back. There he is, back out with the left, flicking the left jab, and then throwing the punches downstairs. Sanchez is dangerously close on a lot of occasions to landing another low blow. This is junior featherweight action. Shot over the top from Sanchez, then he works down on the belt line to work backing Pacquiao up a little bit on the ropes. Pacquiao looking for some hard shots inside, but both those shots missed the mark. Good combinations for Pacquiao. Sanchez okay, stop, will hold. Stop, stop. Will clutch and grab a little bit. Dinkin steps. You can bet all of the Philippines that are watching the fight are with their man tonight. He is a huge national hero. Now he goes to work.
Crowd getting quite a kick out of the action in this fight. Now, Manny's holding on one hand, sneaks in a little left jab with his left hand there. That we've had a little bit of everything. Been a lot of wrestling, a lot of clutching and grabbing, and then Manny is not a lot of secret to what he's trying to do. He wants to throw big punches, and he can take big punches. Sanchez standing right there, working combinations, but now we see blood on the left eye of Sanchez pouring down. I believe something has opened up over the fighters continue to throw, but the story in round five has been the blood coming from the left eye of Manny, of uh, Agapito Sanchez. Manny Pacquiao has been bleeding since the second round. Both fighters just throwing. That's the end of round five. People on their feet. You look at the blood streaming down. Look at change. This is a, you know, you can go one way or the other in that round. Uh, they were both throwing and. You should retaliate back then. Yes. Just who do you like? Man, he just landed one right on the nose right there. And here comes the end of the round. We'll take a look at that again. Sanchez is not back down at one bit. Back out continues to try to throw combinations inside, but he's going to wind up as a one-eyed fighter at the end. We'll have to see. There's not a lot of swelling around it, which is good news. One point earlier was taken away. Sanchez moving back now. That left hand might have hurt him a little bit. Tries a big at standpoint. Time to